everyone welcome back to my channel for today's video i thought i would do a gift guide for her so this can be for anyone if you're a dad a brother a boyfriend a husband or just a friend i hope i can help you find what to get the girl in your life so i have wrote down quite a few ideas on my phone and yeah i thought i'd just go through them and give you some ideas of what girls like bought for them so number one on my list is flowers um flowers can be bought for any occasion it doesn't even have to be an occasion it can just be random um but christmas i think it would be a really nice present to receive some flowers um i know there are some subscription services where you can maybe buy your gal a flower subscription um that would be really nice to like receive flowers every month or however often that is um so yeah i thought that would be a really good gift next on my list is chocolate or any sort of food um a lot of girls say oh i don't want chocolate or any like fatty foods for christmas especially like chocolate and sweets um i know i say it um but obviously I want it so even if they say they don't want it chances are they actually do but they want it obviously bought for them because then they feel oh I'm gonna have to eat it now so yeah chocolate is a must for Christmas my favorite chocolate is Reese's um I love Reese's so much I have a Reese's advent calendar and I look forward to that every morning yeah, another chocolate I like is Lindor. They, they're just one of the best chocolates. Or well, obviously you can buy normal chocolates as well, chocolate bars, literally anything. Next up, and I feel as if this is like a main present for a girl, and that is perfume. So everyone's got their sort of number one perfume. I know mine is Ghost. I think it's called Deep Night. I think it's like a moon shape and I've actually run out so that's on my Christmas list but yeah, I do like so many others there's black opium which is really nice I like bloom by Gucci what else do I like I can't even think but yeah there's so many nice perfumes um maybe someone's ran out of their perfume and they need like a new one to top up or they want to try a completely new perfume so yeah treat them to a perfume next on my list i have airpods or any sort of headphones or even like technology so i do have two pairs i've got the pros and then the normal ones as well i think they're both as good as each other it doesn't matter what sort of pair you get them it's the thought that counts at the end of the day and you can use them for so many different things you can listen to podcasts music use them when you're at the gym when you're cleaning literally anything i love mine and yeah i use them all the time so this next one links in with the technology side of it so if you have a girlfriend or know a girl who wants to start their own youtube then you could always help them out by getting them a camera or something good to film on you could even get them a ring light or like a tripod if they already have a camera so yeah anything that can sort of help them start their YouTube channel and this will be really good to sort of give them that boost that they need to actually start obviously to start you don't actually need all the big equipment you can just film on your phone um, but yeah this can maybe give them a bit of motivation to actually want to start so a really good one actually is a ring light if you don't want to spend too much just in case they don't like stick at it but a ring light is really good you can get them on amazon i've seen them in b m but yeah this is a really good one even to use like with an iphone or to take selfies with so yeah even if they don't want to do youtube a ring light is a really really good one next on my list i have shoes so everyone needs shoes obviously it depends what shoes they like I love Vans. Vans are my number one shoe. I wear my checkerboard um, slip-on Vans every single day without fail. So yeah, I love Vans. Nike Air Force Ones are also one of my favourite shoes. I have some pink suede ones 
which I love to wear but I don't wear them as much as I should because they are suede. So obviously suede are really good for like summer, dry weather but if it's maybe winter time like now get them the, what's it even called? Just like the normal shoe. But yeah if you want to treat them to like a more dressy shoe then the suede option is best. So yeah that's just a few examples obviously you'll have your own taste and yeah shoes next on my list is loungewear loungewear is a really big one for me especially um well most girls probably especially in the time we're in now i wear loungewear every single day i think because we went through lockdown and because i didn't wear jeans for so long i hate wearing them now i hate it obviously i will if i go out but i would much rather be at home in some leggings or trackies so yeah loungewear some companies i love lounge underwear they actually do a loungewear selection and they have all different styles and types so that's a really good one and also angel collection if you are a fan of ellie darby like myself i've got something from every single one of her launches and i don't think i'll ever stop either because the quality and the feel of everything is so nice and yeah that will be one of my number one presents. Next is makeup. So if you've got a girl who likes wearing makeup, treat them to a new lip gloss, a new blush, anything they're sort of in need of, or if they've seen something that's come out recently and they want to try it, treat them to that. An eyeshadow palette is a really good one as well. If they want to experiment with new colours, maybe get them a different sort of style of palette which they wouldn't normally go towards or stick to what they like so you're like in the safe zone or if they're not as into makeup and they don't wear it that often then get them some good skincare so there's so many good skincare brands one that i always go towards is elemis so elemis is a bit more on the pricey side um but it's all totally worth it you can get them a nice night cream or even a day cream. You can get them a cleanser. Literally anything and I'm sure they'll appreciate it. Another brand that's really good is Mario Badescu. So I do have a few bits from there. I don't use it as often but still I do love it. I use like different things from there. So I know they have a drying lotion which is for spots and I do use that if I get an odd breakout. So that's a really good one if anyone ever suffers from some breakouts or you get more high-end brands like Charlotte Tilbury they do the best face cream which is called magic cream um, and yes it is magic and they also do some really nice makeup bits as well if you want to go a bit more high-end and then lastly on my list is jewelry so an obvious brand for jewelry is Pandora they have so many nice different things um, I used to wear Pandora jewellery quite a lot. I don't tend to anymore. I think because it used to be like really popular. But I think now because so many people wear it, I don't tend to go for that as much. But they do really nice bracelets if you want to get them a bracelet and then some charms maybe to go on it. They have new Disney charms I believe. So if they're into Disney, that might be a good idea. And they do have really nice rings as well and they're all really reasonably priced. Jewellery I tend to go for is mainly jewellery from ASOS. All different brands but you can find some really nice bits on there. And yeah, not all of it's that cheap either. So it's really good quality and it does last really well. Or if you would like to go towards a more expensive brand then I'd highly recommend Tiffany. I do wear a Tiffany bracelet, I've got it on and my jumper. And it's one of my favourite pieces of jewellery. And yeah, I love it. And that is my gift guide for her. So I'd really appreciate it if you could let me know down below of any other sort of gift ideas that I may have left out. But other than that, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you tomorrow for another day of Vlogmas.